So this here is one of my favorite spiders. This is what I know as a daddy long leg in California. I've seen other spiders called daddy long legs before in different uh, documentaries and videos. And they look totally different than this one. But this is what I've grown up knowing as a daddy long leg. From what I understand, their mouths are pretty much too small to be able to bite us. Or at least that's what they told me when I was a kid. And as you can see, there's a roach in there that I saw walking across the driveway. I was able to hit it with the fly swatter. And then I came and put it in this guy's web. It's probably a female, actually. But it's been wrapping it up for a couple minutes now. And you can see one in the back there. Like way in the back there. Or over here. That I gave it maybe a week ago. You can see how strong it is. It's actually able to move this giant bug. And it'll pull it off over to the side somewhere to safely feed on it. But I usually try and help these spiders whenever I see them. They can get pretty big for what they are. Nothing big enough to scare you. Just thought it was neat. This one's been living here for actually over a month. Its web covers everything down everything down here all the way up 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 through here and up through here. Let me see if I can um Yeah, I don't know if the light will pick it up. But it's it's a huge web. It's like over two and a half feet tall. I don't know why it made it so big. It never goes up to the top. Pretty neat.